What you show prospective customers on your webpage is directly linked to the chance of them showing up on your dealership floor. Find out what matters. Content is really important and uh, you know that's why people are on the site. So we see consumers who are coming in if content is not there, if there's no inventory on the website, we measure a huge defection. Uh, if there's inventory without pricing in the content, we measure a huge defection from uh, the website. 76% um, of people who have visited a website and say they're going to visit the dealership have seen a price. Those that haven't, 26% will leave because they haven't um, seen the price or the right inventory content. So um, content's important and we measure what consumers see and what they do afterwards. Or to define content, uh, reviews I guess would have to be in there, right? Reviews or content, uh, sure. Right, and write-ups about uh, dr dr ride and drives or whatever. Yeah. Specs, specifications. Yeah, specifications. Uh, and of course photos and video. That's content. That's content and everything about the dealership, um, testimonials like you had mentioned, um, everything about the vehicles, new launches, video, there's, uh, all those things are categorized as content. So if I was a dealer, based on your data, I would have some content uh, right up there at the top, I would have a video right up there at the top, mm -hmm. and I would have a display ad right up there at the top. That, yeah. Would that be the closest thing to an integrated model I could get, I guess? Yeah, you might have a display ad or a cell that rotates things that you think the consumer is interested in. Um, Advertising is really done outside the dealer site more than on their on the site, but of course they do uh, rotate content to see what the consumer is interested in. We've all seen that on uh, dealer websites where you'll see a, one vehicle and then it'll flip around. You'll see another vehicle and just trying to display the wares.